everyone and welcome back to another uh, session in our virtual camp of Summer in Color. Right now you are looking at the instructions for your own mini art pendulum. So with this in the back you should have two cups that look like this. You're going to notice that they have two holes in them. Okay and then you'll have some string. For this you're going to want to make your own paint uh, or you can use washable paint if you have some already pre-made. So you could go back to the baggie that we had that has the Kool-Aid packet or the food coloring to use to make your own paint. Or like I said, you can use your own paint that's already pre-made. Right. For this activity, you might need a couple other things from around your house. Um, some of the things might be is that if you don't want to hold the apprentice at all, you can get two chairs and have them spaced out far from each other, okay? So if this is one chair, this is another chair, and have the backs facing each other, okay? And then you're gonna put a broom on top of the chairs. Um, that way you can string the, or put this, have the broom go through the hole of your cups and your string, and then it can swing from there like this in a circular motion. Pretty cool, huh? Um, or you can hold it yourself. You might just get a little bit of paint on you, whatever you feel comfortable with. But with this, what you're going to do is that you're going to poke a hole in the bottom of the cup after you fill this up with paint. So you can make your own paint again, or you can have pre-made paint that you already have out, and you can use that instead of uh, making your own. And what you're gonna do is that you're gonna have a piece of paper or something on the bottom that you want to paint, and you're gonna have this move in a circular motion, and the paint is gonna drip out of this, and it's gonna drip in a circular pattern. And so it's pretty cool if you do it with multiple colors, because then you're gonna get a really cool design. We'll come back in the next video, and I'll show you how it's done. You can see in the beginning of the video that um, I set it up where I had two chairs and a broom-like object to hold the string in the cup. I did it that way so then I wouldn't get any paint on me, but if you're comfortable with getting paint on yourself, go for holding it yourself. Totally okay. But um, you can see that I have the two chairs spaced a good enough uh, width apart from each other. And then I have the broom and then I put the cup and the string on the broom and then hung the broom from the top of the chairs and that's how I got my pendulum to work. All right so here are a little bit of notes when it comes to the mini art pendulum activity. I found it to be a little bit easier for the paint to come out of the cup hole, the hole in the cup that you guys put in there later on, uh, when it is a little bit watered down. So add just a little bit of water, give it a good store, and then it will be great, good to go, easy peasy lemon squeezy. Um, make sure that you are creating the hole in the cup after you get all the paint mixed up. This activity is going to get messy, I promise you. So it might be best for you to do it outside, maybe on some grass, maybe on a cloth, on cement. Just do it outside so you don't get a big mess inside or anywhere else that you don't want the paint to be.